Ooh, you know what day it is, baby. We giving away electric reels today. The Kraken X electric reel. And you, you know what else we're doing? We're drinking a bottle of wine. <sighs> it has been quite the week. Let me tell you something. Can we get... All right, you know what? I already know what questions I'm going to ask the live chat here in a little bit. We're going to give away some gift cards. We're going to give away some electric reels. We're giving away potentially a fishing trip, a bunch of gift cards, and we're going to drink some wine. You know, it's been a, it's been a while since I've had some wine. I tell you what, I've been sick for, for quite a while. Because of that damn Utah trip. Something about that cold ass air gets me riled up. Uh, how's everybody doing in the chat? Sonia, first one to say hey. What's up? Roger, Michael, Ozzy. Authentic Journey, Scott. What's up, man? Jam Productions. Kendall. All right. I look like I'm feeling better. <laughs> I am feeling better. <coughs> You see, you just jinxed me. You just made me cough. No, but I, I'm, I'm feeling all right. You know, I'm feeling good enough to, uh, to have ourselves a little party. What's the giveaway? Uh, we're giving away an electric reel. We're giving away, and then all the fishing club members are getting some all the all the monthly prizes, and we're also giving away some gift cards to y'all in the live chat. So, uh, I was like, what's going on on the TV behind me? I just saw like a hand moving around. I was like, I hope there's not some weird stuff playing on the TV. Oh, damn. Look at, what do you guys think about the, uh, the new sign? <laughs> oh. <laughs> Big dog, what up? <laughs> oh man, all right, all right, listen up, listen up. This is how we're gonna do it today, all right? Oh, I got the current sales. Current sales on SouthBorderFishChannel.com is $141. If we can hit, if we hit $500, all right, I'm, I'm going to start drinking this bottle of wine because we already got $141, so that'll be like here. But if we if we get $1,000 of sales on this stream, I will kill the whole damn bottle. And that shouldn't be too hard because we've, we've hit $2,000 in the past on a stream. And now every purchase is a chance to win an electric reel. So... Things are as good as they will ever get, I believe. <laughs> All right, check it out. I'm using one of these. Where did I get this from? Oh, you know where this is from? This is from Iceland. So it was our last day in Iceland, and I didn't buy myself any souvenirs because, honestly, most souvenirs end up in the trash. And we were at this restaurant, and I really liked the restaurant. And... Uh, yeah, kind of grabbed this on the way out. And it's it's the best souvenir ever because I actually use it. <sighs> yeah. It wasn't the most exciting story, but you know. Where's a good place to get scuba certified? In the Florida Keys, baby. Come to Key Largo and Scott will uh, certify you. Push the celebration sign, yeah. Am I still working on my studio? I'm always working on my studio. It is a never ending pro pro process. <clears throat> oh, Fish Gold Therapist, you got your uh, 
Dive certification completed. Nice. Heck yeah. What, what reefs did you guys dive on? Scott. Yes, when we lost the gas tank. Yeah, we were driving in in Iceland and our gas tank just fell off the fell off of our Jeep. And like we we still went like maybe maybe like a football field or two. And then we ran out of gas. Oh, did you guys hear that? Cha-ching, baby. We just got an order for $64. Who was that? Let me give a big appreciation to whoever placed that order. Because that means I get to drink more wine. Man, I'm, I'm ready. Okay. Thank you, Paul. And Paul got himself the six-pack of the Game and Fish seasoning. Thank you, Paul. Let me update the current sales and let's have ourselves a glass of wine, shall we? What is that? 60... What is 64 plus? That would be $205. All right, $205. Man, we are going to hit $1,000 today. Easy. I don't even think we have to try it. I could have made it a little easier for you guys, though, and added some cool new merch to the store, which I have been slacking on the merch, but we got a lot of merch. And the reason I haven't put it in the store yet is because I want to take pictures with it, but I probably should just add it. But uh, we got the boat daddy hats. We got we got the, the boat daddy boat bag. This is perfect for towels and your rain jackets. Oh man, we got the South Florida Fishing Channel rain jackets. You know, we got we got all the. Uh, we got um, trucker hats, flags. Where's the flag? Hold on. I'm gonna, I'm gonna show you guys this big ass flag I got. Oh wait, never mind. Never mind. Never mind. I forgot. I put the flags downstairs. Okay. Ugh. One bottle is just a warm-up. Dr. Tom, listen, I don't drink that much anymore. One bottle is going to put me down. <laughs> like, um, uh, I'm telling you, it's going to put me down. How do I exit out of this? All right, there we go. You know what I did today? You guys want to know what I did today? Why I don't? If you follow me on Instagram, you would have watched me. So this week, I decided to ask oh. my followers. Oh, again. shit. Hold on. <laughs> this is what I did today. Went out deep into the mangroves, caught myself some slob mangrove snapper. And you know what I was fishing on? I was fishing on... The inflatable fish skiff. We got deep in the mangroves. It was a good time. Um, that's what I did today. And I got some mangrove snapper sitting in the cooler. And that video should be out. I don't know. I'll try to get it out as fast as possible. Scott, can you use the gift card to reach the thousand dollar goal? Yeah, Scott, I think so. I'm not sure. Uh, I'm not sure how that rings up in Shopify. You could try and I'll see if it counts it as a sale. It might just show up as zero dollars earned though. You stole this corkscrew. Hey, don't say that so loud. Okay, I didn't steal the corkscrew. All right, we spent like eight hundred dollars there. I think, I think we were entitled to the corkscrew. <laughs> Yeah, I guess that is uh probably probably shouldn't tell people that I took a corkscrew from a restaurant. Actually, I think we spent way more than eight hundred bucks there. I think that entitles you to one corkscrew. All right, corkscrew has been inserted.
I just realized I'm so stupid sometimes. At the beginning of this stream, I was like, I already know what questions I'm going to ask to the live stream. Never mind. I'm not even going to say it because I'm just, I'm already digging a hole. Never mind. Mm. I suck at asking you guys questions and I always answer the questions before I even ask them. God, I'm so stupid. Right. Make sure you get that wine to breathe. Oh, what's the best way to get my wine to breathe? Do I have to just like, wait, how many, how, what are we at sales 205? Oh, that's not, that's not quite a quarter bottle. That's like a fifth of a, of a bottle. Wait, 200, that is a fifth of a bottle. Can someone place an order so I could pour myself as more of a stout glass? Is that a fifth of a bottle? All right, there we go. That is a fifth of a bottle. Mm. Ooh, we are drinking. We just got ourselves a bottle of Josh. You know, keep it simple, but good. Um, I actually really like this stuff. Josh is pretty good. A very... So how do I let it breathe? Like this? You know that I'm the master swirler? All my friends here in the Keys like have this joke. Like, because I will, you give me any drink, whether it's a beer, a wine, a mixed drink, and I just start swirling it. And I will swirl it, usually until it comes out of the glass and gets all over myself. And it's like a running joke. <clears throat> Cody, did I see Bitcoin? Did, didn't Bitcoin split and now it's like, I think it's split. I always, I always got myself some Bitcoin, man. You know, I, I was buying Bitcoin back in 2009. I think I bought my first Bitcoin. I, I was using and buying Bitcoin before people even knew what Bitcoin was. All right, look at this bad boys. Okay, it doesn't smell aerated quite enough, but let's give it a sip. I think blowing into it will aerate it quicker. Oh, I just heard another order come in. <laughs> Let's see. Ooh, someone else got the seasonings, I think. Let me see. James. Big shout out, James. Thank you for that order. Yep. <coughs> James got himself a pack. Oh, a pack of the seasonings. All right. So now we're at like two, two. I'll just round it up. Let's I'll just round it right up to 250. How about that? Oh wait, no, we're above two. 270. Woo! All right. Hey, James, this pour is for you. <coughs> okay. <laughs> Hugh. Oh, this bottle is definitely the first thing that I've drank today. I have been, I woke up at seven, I worked till 12 then i fished and filmed a bunch of videos and then i spent two hours getting this live stream ready and now i'm having my first drink and i'm freaking been waiting all day for this it's probably been a it's probably been like six months since the last time I had red wine. Ooh, wow. My old friend. <laughs> mm. All right. Yours outdoors. Oh, James. Thank you, James. Oh. Hey, Cody, good to see you in here. By the way, Cody, all the fishing 
all, all the fishing reels are getting shipped out this week. Um, so everybody should be getting their stuff. I think you're you're getting you and Stephanie are getting like three three fishing reels. My wine pour looks like your bour bourbon pour. Damn boy! Do you put ice cube in your bourbon? <laughs> oh, Sonia said Mark is shopping on S F F C. Oh, by the way, Sonia, you're you're getting the uh, I'm, I'm shipping you the backpack that you wanted, the camo backpack from PC Fun. You woke up this morning and got yourself a beer. Damn. All right, well. I don't remember the last time I did like a morning drinking, but it sounds good. I think like if you're gonna, if you're gonna, if you're gonna drink, you might like make a whole day out of it, right? I think that's great. Great, great idea. Damien. <laughs> hello, hello to both of you. Get rid of the glass, just drink out of the bottle. That's not a bad idea, actually. Uh, Eric, if things have shipped, there is a spreadsheet called the Fishing Club Headquarters, I think. If you are in the, if you're in the, um, if you're in our live chat, in the, in the club members live chat, I can post the, uh, I can post the spreadsheet in there later, but you should be able to see it in there. Pirates don't use a glass. Damn it, big dog. Here we go. It's not aerated. This is, this is barely aerated. Woo! <sighs> Damn. All right. Oh, all right, this is what we're gonna do. Okay, so this is the game plan. What is, what is, all right, the game plan for this live stream is, I'm gonna do the fishing report because because the fish are biting and I gotta tell you where, I gotta tell y'all where they at. And then after the fishing report, damn, there's a lot of noises going on in here. I need a, Oh, cha-ching, baby. After the fishing report, we're just gonna drink some wine until we hit $500 in sales. And then once we got $500 in sales, which honestly at this rate is probably only gonna take, I don't know, 10 minutes. <laughs> then we are gonna start the giveaways. <clears throat> if you've placed an order on South Florida Fishing Channel, in the month of March, we are giving away an electric fishing reel on this stream. Remember, $1 gets you one entry, and uh, we got a random name picker set up here, and we're gonna it's going to pick somebody. So we're doing that giveaway. I'm also going to give away a couple gift cards to anybody that's placed an order in the March in the month of March. And then also, I'm giving away another electric reel to anyone that makes a purchase during the month of April. So anyone that makes a purchase today on this stream or has made a purchase this month is going to be in the next electric reel giveaway. And I'll also be giving away some gift cards to you guys in the chat. And, uh, and then, of course, we're doing our fishing club giveaway too, which is a fishing trip with me. A $500 gift card, a electric reel, and then a couple other things. I forget. <laughs> I'll pull up the website in a second. Um. Oh, I wanted to mention this right off the bat because I got a I got a lot of people hitting me up after the live stream last time because I guess we talked about how I used to have a software business, and I still do. And some people asked me if I still build websites and still build software, which I do. I'm going to thank you guys in a second, whoever just placed those last two orders. Let me show you guys something. If you guys ever need a website built or need, 
how do I change my thing here? Okay, this is our our website, enzlo.com. That's E-N-Z-L-O dot com. And if you guys ever want any kind of software work done here, everything that we do is mentioned down here. We do full stack development, UI design, e-commerce solutions, cloud, and um, anything from accounting, project management, team management. So we do servers and database. We do all that setting up. <laughs> we do mobile app development. Con we do some content, marketing, lead generation, and outreach, and SEO. We do, we do all that shenanigans. We've been doing this since 2011 when we started this company and we have expanded quite nicely and we have a lot of really awesome projects under our belt that we have just completely schwackadoodle dude and uh if you ever need any assistance with any business idea you know we, we also do consulting anything we have launched started so many products services everything you probably you name it we've done it but it, our email is right on this website. There, there, there's like this little button. You can either copy our email or thing or this button, and you will get in contact directly with my brother, who will assist you in any way possible. Uh, and that is that's my software company for y'all that have been asking. I've get so many questions about it. So if you ever want to check us out, you can just check us out enzlo.com. Bam. But uh because so many people think that the fishing channel is like my only job. <laughs> the fishing channel has always been more of my hobby. Um but it's kind of a full-time thing now. It feels like a hobby, but I spend more hours on it than people spend on full-time jobs. All right, what is going on here? I wish so bad I could play music on these live streams. That would be a lot of fun. Scott, thank you for placing that order. You got yourself some snapper rigs and freeliner rigs. Yes, and you know what? It does count. <clears throat> Even though you used your gift card, it still it still is gonna count to our daily goal. So thanks. Thanks for all the support, Scott. And Eric, thank you. Oh, <laughs> you got yourself the six pack of seasonings. Man, the seasonings are selling hot today. Woo wee. Awesome. Thank you guys so much for all your support. I think I might, okay, at the rate that we're going, I think I need to drink faster. I was worried about this. You know what's really kind of embarrassing? I've drank like four sips of wine and I'm already feeling it. <laughs> oh my, oh boy. When is it going down with the fish skiff 16 doing some open water fishing? Maya's outdoors fishing. It's going to happen soon. So if you watch the video that I'm going to be posting in a couple of days here, um, I got I got my registration plate on it. Everything is looking so good. And we're going to be, uh, I'm probably going to be doing some stupid stuff on that boat. Sonia, thank you so much for your order. Oh, more seasoning, some pompano rigs and some yellowtail hooks. Oh, pompano rigs. You're ready for a pompano trip. So I actually reached out to two people today um, about the pompano fishing and I'm getting mixed reviews and it's really windy. So the, the wind is blowing a bunch of weeds on the beach, which is not good for beach fishing. So I'm, so if you're part of the fishing club, we are planning a pompano beach fishing day. I'm gonna be bringing stuff to grill. I'm gonna bring rods. We're gonna have a bunch of pompano rigs and bait. And we're just going to put out a bunch of lines, lay on the beach, cook some food, have a cooler full of cold drinks. It's going to be a good freaking time. And uh, I'm just waiting for the, the proper reports to come in. 
um, for when we're going to do that. And if you want to get into the fishing club, southforfishchannel.com, there's the join the fishing club button up here on the top and you can join the club and it is, you can get into our live chat and all of our events and everything for $20. And then you're also in the, the fishing club giveaway every month. Um, and that is a monthly fee, but you can cancel anytime. So you can just pay the $20, cancel your membership. You'll still be in the giveaways and you get cl uh, club chat ac access for life and you get invites to all of our events for life. And uh, so, yeah, it'd be cool, you know, if some new people want to join. Uh, the, the last time that we had a, a, a fishing club meetup, it was supposed to be a bass fishing trip meetup. But I think we only had like 10 people in the club at the time and no one could make it. <laughs> so so uh, the more people we can get in the club, the better. I would have a lot of fun there. Should we do the fishing report? I think we should. All right, today is April 17th, 2024. And the mahi and tuna are biting. I got lots of reports. Um, big thank you to Thad, he sent me a report. They caught some big, big blackfin tuna and lots and lots of mahi between 250 to 350 feet of water, just right off Molasses Reef. If you don't know where that is, if you're out in Key Largo, Molasses Reef is pretty much just right here. Uh, like, yeah, like right here. That's Molasses Reef. So the tuna and the mahi are just right offshore and 350 feet, which is probably like right about here. And they're just cruising down, coming down. They're biting. So if you want to go fish for them, it's a good time to do it. The swordfish are also biting. The mutton bite still seems to be pretty good in the deeper waters. Um, we'll see how long that lasts for. <coughs> oh, sorry, I got a lot of messages coming in here. Okay, I do not know how to mute. Hold on, can I uh, mute? Options, options, mute, mute for today. All right, I just muted my notifications. And tomorrow's forecast is two to four foot seas, 14 to 18 knots of wind. It seems like for the past three months, we could not, cannot get away from the wind. So if you do want to run offshore and catch some tuna in mind, you're probably going to get beat up pretty good. But that's just what we're dealing with. Take it for what it is. And if you got your own fishing report, please let us know in the live chat and I will shout out your fishing report. Cody, nice. Yeah, I look forward to our Pompano fishing trip. You haven't been in the live chat in a while. <laughs> you guys must be busy. How's how's everything going? You, you passed your exams, right? That was a while ago. Can't wait for May deep dropping. Oh man, the deep drop. This deep drop season is going to be like no other. I'm going to be deep dropping so hardcore. And I'm going to be doing very in-depth reviews on the Kraken X. I have a bunch of these electric reels. I'm going to spool one up with 20 pound braid. I'm going to spool one up with 30 pound braid. And I'm going to spool one up with 40 pound braid. We're going to test a bunch of different things with them. And remember what happened last year when I put out the deep drop videos? The Kraken X reels sold out in like a week and you couldn't get them until the next year. So that's probably going to happen again. So if you do not have yourself a Kraken electric reel, you probably want to go on PCFun.com and order yourself one. You could get 18% off with my code, which is right down there on the screen, right, right there. The code SFFC18. These things are going to sell out. And don't say I didn't tell you so when it happens, because that's what happened last time. And then somehow people were mad at me for them selling out. They're like, why would you promote a product that's sold out? I was like, they weren't sold out when I was promoting them. <laughs> Some people were legit mad at me about that, but I don't control that.
Nice, Stephanie. Yeah, I hope you guys are going to be there. That's going to be awesome. Uh, it'll probably be, it'll probably, probably be at the end of this month sometime. It probably won't be next week because in three days, it's my birthday, 420. And so I, there's, I usually, for my birthday every year, I go on like a two or three day party mode because it's it's Dan's birthday then it's my birthday and then there's a couple more birthdays like all within a day of each other so we we have a lot of fun <laughs> the physical therapist you saw a big mutton on your dive last week but you couldn't touch him because he was in the sanctuary damn Andy, bought a bunch of stuff from them. Great customer service, great products, and I'll do it through UF PC Fund. Yeah, honestly, when PC Fund first reached out to me, I was very skeptical. I was like, I was like, oh, okay. I was like, I, we didn't even sign a contract at first. They wanted to sign a contract with me, and I was just like, wait, before we do anything like that, I was like, just send me some reels, just so I could even test them. And the second I got the reels, I was like, oh, these are actually pretty nice. And then I hit them back and I was like, all right, all right, let's do it. Let's sign the contract. And they have been a proud sponsor of this channel for almost a year now, nine months. So cheers to PC Fun and cheers to Sea Eagle, our newest channel sponsor. All right, Stephanie, I'll definitely let you guys know. I'll let you guys know in the fishing chat what the plans are for my birthday. Maybe maybe we can all meet somewhere, you know? Have a little birthday fun. Did we just get another order? Wait. Nope, we didn't. But what are we at? What are our orders at today? Oh, damn. Oh, damn, damn, damn. I need to catch up. We are at $457 in sales. Let me update the page. $457. The giveaway is about to start. Woo! And I should be about halfway done with my bottle, and I'm like three sips into my first gl glass. Oh, I did not think this through. PBS Kids Complain, be honest, how do they compare to International and Shimano? Well, I know some things that I can't quite divulge, especially on a live stream, but let's just say pretty much exactly the same. <laughs> the only difference is PC Fun, um, they don't make those like really big, like the 10,000s and the the 14,000s, the big spinning reels, like the really big offshore stuff that like Shimano makes. So I hope one day that they make the really big stuff, but they're like, they're 500,000. Here, I'll just show you. Can I pull it up? PC fun here. Um, let me Let me show you guys like what I'm trying to tell you guys. So their reels, <laughs> hey, you know what? Well, I just noticed this. I didn't even notice. Wait, 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 wait. Why? Look at this reel. It says PC Fun Kraken Electric Big Game Reels Heiko Recommended Fishing from $139. Wait, what? It's not $139. Okay, <laughs> $469. But plus, plus if you use my code, it's a bigger discount. Why did it say $194? Okay, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Okay, uh, wait, wait, okay. So what I was saying, I just got so sidetracked. So they're like their Carbon X. I love the Carbon X, this reel right here. It only goes up to 3,000. 
right? So their biggest reel is a 3000, which is great for patchery fishing. Shoot, that's even like for mahi, that's even fine. Um, and then like they have some bigger ones like the 5000. What does this one go up to? This one goes up to a 4000. So they make great reels, but they don't make the really big spinning fishing reels that I, I really like offshore. But, um, but yeah, it's, it's fun, light action stuff. If you're fishing like the mangroves, patch reefs, if you're pitching the mahi, these reels are awesome. But it, you know, if you're vertical jigging, these reels aren't gonna work. Unless you use their slow pitch reels. Where's their slow pitch reels at? Like this guy right here. Wait, no, that's not the slow pitch reel. Here it is. That <clears throat> This one. This is the slow pitch reel. For, uh, yeah, vertical jigging. I like it. I got it. I've used it in a couple videos. I've caught fish on it. Have no have had no issues with it. And it's a third of the price of the other ones, so I don't know. Can't really complain. <clears throat> oh, this is the one. This is the one I was looking for. Oh, it's sold out. Okay, this reel, I caught some nice fish with this vertical jigging reel. And like the problem is anytime I make a video catching fish on a certain reel, the product sells out. <laughs> so uh I'm sorry for everyone trying to get this. This is actually a really awesome reel. This is probably like a $300 reel that you're getting for less than $159 if you use my code. So those are the PC fun reels. But huge, they're a huge supporter of the channel. So big, big shout out to PC fun. They have had my back for a long time now. Oh, brim of the hat. Yeah, I got I got some junk on my hat, don't I? <laughs> Brand new hat. I take it fishing one time and I got crap all over it. <laughs> Dang it, that didn't take long. What kind of wine are we sipping? Uh just just a nice basic, basic but good bottle of Josh, you know? Keeping it classy, keeping it real. And should I chug this? If you think, it, all right, if you guys want me to chug the rest of this, say yes or chug. Say chug in the chat right now. If I start seeing a couple of chugs in there, I will do it. And to make it just a little more exciting, I'll make it even a bigger of a chug. Oh, damn, that's not good. That's a bad idea. Chug. Chug, 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 chuggle it, chuggle it, chuggle it, chuggle it, chuggle it, chuggle it, chuggle it. All right, chug it. Cody said chug it, he'll get another bourbon. Cody just caught a few bass out back on the PC Fun 500. Nice, you know what's funny, Cody? I was using the 500 today too. And I caught a couple real nice mangrove snappers. So cheers, boom, both caught some fish on it. This is a terrible, this, do you guys understand? This is actually a pretty big cauldron of wine. That's kind of a lot of wine. Andy, thank you for the motivation. Red wine hangovers are the worst. Thank, thank you, Andy. That uh, really is getting me really excited about doing this. All right. <laughs> Miami making sense is, is just sip it. Just sip it. I, I would just sip it, but I did just tell everyone I was going to chug it. And it's too late now. I said I was going to do it, so. Mm. <laughs> uh, 
honestly, I felt like I was doing a disservice to that one. Mm. All right. All right. Okay. Hmm. I need a. I need a light. I need a. I need to contemplate what just happened there. Okay. <laughs> okay. Wow. I'm not 21 anymore. I tell you what. Woo. Did I? Sonia, you want to know the worst part? I did not eat dinner today yet either. And I didn't eat breakfast either. All right. Well, we are at, we are, I believe, what are our sales at now? Let me see how much wine I have to pour. Oh my Lord. Who just put that order in? Who put that order in? Cody, thank you for the order. Line cutters and seasonings. Nice. Jason, thank you for the order. Jason got himself some seasonings. Man, y'all smashing it on the seasonings. Are my eyes turning red? Why do they look so red? Don, thank you for your order, Don. Oh, you got yourself some koozies. Yeah. And some seasonings. Nice. Uh, I am hungry. I'm very hungry. But um, I, <coughs> I've been kind of spending like the last week cutting, trying to cut down a little bit on my food intake because I started getting a little fat. <laughs> All right. No, but for the past two years now, I've been eating close to four to 5,000 calories a day. Some days I'll even do 6,000 calories. And uh, sometimes I just get overwhelmed and I feel like it's, it's just nice to take like, take like a week off where I just don't eat that much. I like kind of fasting, but I, not fasting, you can't call it fasting because I, I do eat. I just don't, I eat like 3,000 calories. Someone farted on my pillow. Are you telling me that I got pink eye? All right, so I got about here. We got about half the bottle done. Well, it's not done. I like it's in my glass. But uh, hey, we just got another order. All right, I gotta update the sales. We're moving ahead quick. It's I think it's time to start some giveaways. Oh ho! Damn, that was a big order. Elizabeth, hey Elizabeth. By the way, Elizabeth, you have um, your electric reel shipped. Your electric reel's on the way. Thank you for that order. What'd you just put in? You got yourself a hat and a bunch of weedless squid rigs. Hey, the weedless squid rig never fails. All right. Oh, another sale. I'm over here like panicking a little bit. I feel it. I already feel that tingle in my legs. Damn, that didn't take long. All right. We still have three fourths of a bottle to go. Are the shirts available? Well, which shirts are available? Oh, wait, somebody asked me about Boat Daddy. Okay, quick little Boat Daddy update. Um, we're taking no more beta testers, okay? No more beta testers. We had enough beta testers and we are launching, hmm. You know, if you've ever, if you've ever developed software, <laughs> you never hit your deadlines. Like, it's so impossible. I've never met a company that has ever hit a deadline. 
And um, I'm so my original deadline with the Boat Daddy app launch was supposed to be 420, which is three days because that's my birthday, and I, it was going to be like a huge celebration. My app's in the store, yeah. But <clears throat> you know, like we're probably about two weeks behind, so we're we're looking we're looking like early May. We'll be in the app stores, but don't worry. I'll let you know. You'll know. We have a bunch of um, a bunch of influencers that are going to be promoting it. We, I have. It's going to be big. Mark, thank you for your order. The windbreaker. Oh man, I love the windbreaker. I. It is a good one. Okay, what are we at with sales? Oh, oh Lord. Okay. Uh -huh. Let me update the sales. We are at 835 dollars. Honestly, it looks like I'm gonna be drinking the whole bottle of wine. Boat Daddy stickers for your Chevy. Yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. Carlos, I hope you're going to be the number one boat daddy on the app. Uh, JM, can you explain what boat daddy is? Okay, I'll give you the quick the little elevator pitch. So, so boat daddy connects people with boats to people that want to get on boats. So if you got a boat, you can find fishing buddies, spear fishing buddies. Maybe you need a wakeboarding buddy. Maybe you just don't want a, a, a diving buddy or something. Like you don't want to dive alone. You can find a diving buddy. Or maybe you're just looking for chicks to go to the sandbar with and party. You can use the app any way that you want. You can select who can see you. So like, you know, if, if you're married, and you want to get on Boat Daddy to find a fishing buddy, you can tell your wife, like, look, I've restricted young females from seeing my account. <laughs> but, um, but yeah, no, the, the app really is to just bring more people together on the water. It's uh, completely free to use. It's, uh, yeah, it's like a social app where you can log in and then you can see all the, if you're like, let's say you're someone that doesn't have a boat, and you, so like, let's say you're someone from, you're a couple of chicks from New York that are down in the Keys on vacation and you just want to get out on a boat. You want to go you see the sandbar. You've never been out on a boat and you just don't know what to do. You can get on Boat Daddy and it'll show you everyone near you in like a 60 mile radius. It'll show you all the Boat Daddies and you can message them and you guys can, and then you guys can chat and boom, figure something out. So it's just a way of honestly like just bringing more people together <laughs> grinder boat daddy but yeah no it's gonna be it's gonna be pretty sweet also there's gonna be a like a section for events near you so you can find events uh find things going on there's a section for charter captains to list their charters so if you want to book a charter you can search charters based on location and it'll show you all the charters in the area um yeah it's gonna be everything and you know what a chick can be a boat daddy too i've already had a couple girls ask me they're like hey i have a boat can i be a boat daddy and i was like yeah you can be a boat daddy and like we got girls wearing boat daddy hats saying i'm a boat daddy on their boats so it's like you know we're all there's Anyone can be anything, <laughs> especially these days. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> uh, Captain Bill, am I making all those rigs by myself? All of our rigs are made. We have a warehouse in Inverness, Inverness, Florida, kind of out by uh, Clearwater area, Tampa. And yeah, all, all rigs are tied packaged and shipped right out of Florida. I know, Kenneth, I know. 
the red wine's talking. I'm actually getting a little worried because I'm live and there's, how many people are watching? Oh man, 150 people. And I'm, I'm, I'm only, I'm not even a third of the bottle down yet and I am tingling hardcore. God, don't, I like, the less I talk, the better. But there's no, there's no distractions. I have no one else here with me. There's no music playing. It's just me and my voice. It's kind of like, it's kind of a lot to handle. But you guys are here too. You're the chat. It's like I'm talking to people and like whatever you guys write in the chat feels like, like I read what you say in my head and it feels like someone's here saying it to me. So I, I feel, uh, I feel like there's a huge party going on. What happened to the long sleeve fishing shirts, Brian? Uh, we we put a hold on those for now because they're just, it was a lot. Those fishing shirts were a lot. Um, I was I was actually kind of losing money on those shirts. It was bad. So, and then they took a while to make, so people were not happy with the orders. So now I got a whole different system set up now and they get shipped out pretty quick now. Hugh, I quit smoking in December. Why do I want to sick so effing bad right now? You, you know what I feel? This is how I feel about smoking. Like if you want to have, if you want to have a cigarette, you want to smoke a, a, um, a cigar, have a cigarette, just go for it. But, uh, you know, because I think like doing it once in a once in a while is not a big deal at all. But there's some people like they have one and then they have two and then they have three and they have four and they have five and like and then it's just like a slippery slope. I'm not like that. I can like go out and have one and have zero craving for another one for another like month. <laughs> so I don't know if like I'm lucky because that's just how I feel about it or if there's a way to train yourself to think like that. Hmm. Cause you know how they say like some people are more have a more addictive personality. I always wonder if that's really true or not. I think it's just yeah. I don't know. Never mind. I don't. Know. Why am I even talking about this? Jeez, jeez, boy. We should talk about some fishing or something. <laughs> Okay, let's all right chat you you're steering this conversation so like ask me some good questions Sonia I want to start putting out more merch I have a lot of I have like eight new merch products that I'm just I'm just waiting to put out but I'm gonna start trickling them out I think and then we'll it'll be good Flat days are coming. They sure are. Drink some coffee. No, no, no. I said, you know what? Hey, when I say I'm going to do something, I always do it. That's like one of my life mottos. It's actually a great way to live your life because sometimes I'll just tell someone I'm going to do something like, I'll just be like, I'm going to drive a supercar next week. And then they're just like, okay, sure, whatever. But because I said it, now I have to do it. And then I'm like, okay, I got to go rent one. <laughs> but I do stuff like that all the time. And I always hold myself accountable. So if I say I'm going to drink a bottle of wine on live stream, I'm going to do it. And nothing's going to stop me. Except maybe a heart attack. Captain Bill, you bring your boat to Key Largo. What's biting? Oh, Bill, you missed the fishing report. I did the fishing report just a second ago. I'll do a 10 second synopsis for you. Uh, where is it? Fishing report. There's mahi and tuna in 250 feet. There's muttons if you want to drift 
butterfly uh butterfly ballyhoo drift them on the bottom 120 to 180 you'll probably catch some muttons and the swordfish are biting and i also and there's a bunch of mangrove snappers just about everywhere so <clears throat> go on the pat trees put out a chum bag and they're going to show up <laughs> dr tom says spin the wheel i <laughs> Tom, you might be right. It might, it might be time to spin the wheel. <clears throat> All right. Okay, let me give a couple things here. Alan, or Lisa, Lisa, thank you for your order. The hogfish decal and some seasoning is nice. Thank you, Lisa. Alan, thank you for your order. Koozies and seasonings. Thank you. Anthony, thank you for your order. The hat, lip candy jigs, and the seasonings. Mm. Good choice. Lip candy jigs are killing it. Snapper rig and circle hooks. Mac, thank you for your order. All right, the order. You guys are awesome. What? Are... Oh no, guys, we have hit our goal of a thou of a. Well, we're almost there. Nine hundred ninety-five. Updated. Boom. There we go on the screen. Nine nine five. Sweet. Cobia? Oh, I don't know about the Cobia. You know, I, I'm not an, a Cobia expert. I do some, co Cody, you do some messed up things to catch a mutton or a mahi? Hmm. Kenneth, you're going to smoke a hooter. Is that code for weed or is that code for a cigarette? What is a hooter? I haven't heard that one yet. I need to know. Hooter. What does that mean? Have I seen or heard of any good weed lines? Uh, uh, with all this wind, the weed lines are kind of broken up with all the wind, but there's weed out there for sure. There's an app called Sat Fishing, which is pretty cool. It shows you, I think it shows you where the weed lines are, but yeah. Alan says that's a J, a J, a hooter. I'm going to use that word. I'll be like, yo, who got the hooter? <laughs> that's funny. I've never, in my 32 years of life, I've never heard hooter before. That's so good. I like that. <laughs> How have I not heard that one before? All right. What is giveaway should we start off with should we start off with a heavy hitter give one of the electric reels away <laughs> cody there's weed out there for sure damn i i don't realize how stupid i sound until you quote me like that damn i think should we just start the freaking giveaway hot and heavy with a straight up with an electric reel giveaway. Well, we're giving away two electric reels, so we got two, might as well do it. Cody, you're 32, nice. Honestly, at 32, I'm the biggest and strongest that I've ever been in my whole life. 210 pounds, lean, energy for days. Like, I feel like a Kraken. Like everyone told me like, oh, when you hit, wait till you hit 30, like sh shit gets tougher. I'm like, I'm freaking, I feel it. Especially after this wine. Woo, baby. I feel pretty damn good. I did some math and I think I'm going to be peaking. I'm going to be max peaking at like 45. And I have to just get a little bit better every year until then. <laughs> Bill, you were 32, 32 years ago. Who can do the la math on that? Hooter, hog leg, doob. I haven't heard hog leg either. What the heck? Hooter and hog leg. I like those two. Cody. Yeah, Cody, how old are you? <laughs> Jason, wait till I pass 50. You know what, though? My dad, he's turning 60 this year. 
and uh, he's actually turning 60 in a couple of months and I'm gonna fly over to Utah to see him. But my dad, he can outperform me in kite surfing, in mountain biking, in snowboarding. He is a beast at 60 years old. I'm 32, I cannot keep up with my dad. He is like so athletic and crazy, it's it's wild. He he snowboards every single day when it's when the snow melts, he mountain bikes and he he goes down like scary stuff. Like one time I went uh, mountain biking in California with my dad and I got lost on the mountain and everybody left me and I I pulled my front brakes on accident, which is something you don't do when you go downhill because when you push front brakes going downhill, your your bike just does this and you go flying. And I rolled down boulders and I was just like, oh my God, I'm dead. And I was like, dad, help. And then I realized there was no one there. Everybody, they just kept going. They were like, ah. My dad was probably like, yeah, keep going. <laughs> and, and then I was laying there for a while and I didn't know how to get down the mountain. And I ended up on the other side of the mountain and it, it started getting dark and like, yeah, they were going to like send helicopters for me and stuff, but uh, it, it all worked out in the end. <laughs> Cody, TRT, are you on TRT? I'm currently on no, I am on no, um, I'm on, uh, what do you call that? I am on nothing. I am on bull test though. I have a bottle of it somewhere here. I got like a bottle of bull test in every room. Bull testicles. I eat it every day. All right, let's let's do some giveaways. All right, you guys deserve it. Actually, I know how I want to. I know how I want to start the giveaway. We're gonna start it hot and heavy. First, I'm gonna start by giving away a gift card to someone in the chat right now. That's gonna be the very first thing we do. Then we're giving away an electric reel. And you know what I do now? If you watch the last live stream, what I do now is I got my laptop here and I, I can send the gift card out immediately if I know who the winner is. All right, so let me set that up. Let me get into my Shopify account. All right, all right, yes, 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 no, leave. Okay, yes, accept, accept products, gift cards, create a gift card. All right, let's do $25 gift card. Actually, screw it. We're going to start this stream hot and heavy because you guys are awesome. $50 gift card. First one to answer my question is going to get it. I already, I just put it in my computer. So as soon as someone wins, I can send it right away. See, no more delays. Okay, I'm, I'm working on becoming a faster human being. What What is going on in the chat? I look away for one second and I start reading the, the chat and you guys are saying some crazy things. Who is talking about hot moms? What about hot moms? Hot moms? Oh my Lord have mercy. All crazy in the chat. Hmm. You guys think I should cut a mullet? I need a haircut and I'm debating if I want to go mullet and like be really crazy for like a few months and then go back to normal or if I should just get a normal haircut. I don't know. I don't know. What do you guys think I should do? If I had a mullet for the launch of Boat Daddy, that'd be pretty fun. Now I might go on a bender. I'm a glass and a half deep of wine and I'm already, I feel like I'm on a bender. Jeez, I'm, there used to be a time where I could drink two or three bottles and be told like, handle it. Okay, the question that I'm gonna ask. All right. Look at you, look at you guys trying to already answer the questions. You guys know you're not supposed to do that and you guys do it anyways. <laughs> do a bullet bald on top, mullet and back, god damn, all right. 
Okay. A Ragnar haircut? All right. <laughs> if I get if I drink enough wine, I might do something like that. All right. Um. Here we go. Oh, this is gonna be a fun one too. All right. Here's the question for a fifty dollar gift card. First one to answer it in the chat right now. You guys in the chat. Who? Or okay, not who. All right. This is going to be a tough one. Okay? Because the answers are unlimited. What? What? Hold on, I'm going to grab it so I can show. Holy shit, you guys see that? Oh my god. That is a that is a 2017 video right there. That's crazy. I dated that girl for six years. My God. All right. I'm... All right. The question for $50 gift card and, and two grunts or something. All right, what do I have in this cooler right now? These are, this is what I, what I caught today. There, quantity, quantity, there's more than one fish. There's more than one fish. You can't just say, you can't just say your thing there, right? All right, I need, I need to change this. While you guys answer the questions there, I'm changing it. <laughs> All right. What's in my cooler? What's in my cooler? Is it a fish? Is it a... Jew fish. Is it a green turtle? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> All right. I will admit to you guys is that I am tingling pretty hard right now. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, my wine's empty. Woo, woo, woo. Red alert. Red alert. Oh, damn. Hey, I'll tell you something. After that second glass, it starts to go down pretty quick. It starts to go down pretty nice. <laughs> oh, man. All right, okay. Okay, Um, I'm reading your guys' answers. The physical therapist, okay. Hold on, I'm reading your guys' responses right now. Okay, all right, okay, okay. Somebody, somebody got it right. Yeah! Before I tell you who the winner is, because I see who the winner is. I just did a little scrolling, right? Hold on, let me just, let me make sure I'm actually right. Okay, okay, um, <laughs> cut my hair on live stream. I've done that before, remember that? That was an old live stream. Okay, um, yep, okay, I see who the winner is. All right. I see who the winner is. So how about I just show you guys what the answer is?
<laughs> this could go so bad if I drop this cooler and spill fish guts all over my office. I'm gonna have a field day with myself. All right. Okay. Okay. It's full of ice. <laughs> all right. <laughs> Wait, I don't have a good grip on this cooler. Oh. Okay, this is a bad idea. The water is gonna come out. And the fish are under ice. Damn it. Hold on a second. Bear with me. Oh. Shit, I'm about to drop the cooler. It's slipping. Alright. Oh shit. Okay. Okay. Alright, you know what? This is this is stupid. Why don't I just <coughs> move the stupid ass chair? Okay. There are two fish in my cooler. Dun 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 da 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 dun dun. Oh yeah, this right here is a thirteen-inch mangrove snapper, and this right here is a 17 inch mangrove snapper or like it was like 16.4 so it was like 16 <coughs> round up round. listen if it's 16.1 i round that up to 17 okay <laughs> but those are our mangrove snappers two mangrove snappers and the winners stephanie congratulations Oh man. Wow. Oh, okay. All right, what I have to do, oh. What the fuck is that? Whoa. Wow, shit! Look at that creature. It's blue. Do you guys see that? I just, uh, sorry I screamed. Um, I touched it. I like picked it up and it wrapped itself around my finger. I, I thought it was an alien for a second. I kind of freaked out. So I'm sorry I yelled, but what the hell? It crawled, okay. It crawled out of the gills of one of the snap <laughs> one of the snappers it crawled out of the gills and it touched my finger and it wrapped itself around my finger and now it's on an ice cube going like ah! yeah die die i don't know what you are but you die that's fucked up all right I'm gonna wash my hands real quick. Don't be talking, don't be talking about me in the chat now while I'm gone. Yeah, who's ready for some black pussy to show up to the party? Woo-hoo! Yeah, we got the likes in the house. Yeah, you see that? If you smash the like button, we get that nice little like bubble pop up. 
Look at that. Pop, 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 pop. Thanks for all the likes. I actually don't know where those likes are coming from. All right. All right. Ah. Oh. oh, yeah. Oh, big stretch. Oh, yeah. Oh. Elliot loves to do big stretches. It's his very favorite. Hey. Elliot. Smell that. What do you think? Would you like a sip? <laughs> gotcha. Everyone just saw you, saw me kiss you on stream. <laughs> How embarrassing for you. <laughs> oh, you know things are going downhill when you realize One bottle might not be enough. Yes, he is plotting to my, my demise, yes. All right. By the way, Stephanie, congratulations. Um, Steph. Hey, Stephanie, can you, oh, you know what? Let me ask you in the live chat. I'm gonna ask you in the live chat something. If you. All right. Mm, mm, mm. All right. <laughs> All right, Stephanie, congratulations for that $50 gift card. Now, we got so much more to give away. But listen, I know you guys are not here for the giveaway, right? You guys are here for me, right? Uh, hey, Kenneth, don't worry. Dark humor, me and dark humor go together like fine wine and cheese. All right, yeah, we're we're gonna keep get, we're gonna keep the giveaways going. All right, but first I have to send this. I have to send this gift card out. Three, two, one. Send gift card. <coughs> send gift card. Send it. Boom, Stephanie! I just sent your gift card. Look at that! I am Flash Gordon. I send stuff so quickly now. I should have always done my live streams like this. Honestly, I'm I'm one of the worst giveaway people because I I give away a lot of prizes and then it takes me like weeks, sometimes months to send them out. I always send it out. I always send it out, but sometimes it takes me a long time and and like. So I'm really trying to be better about that. So I, I want to be instant now. If you win a reel, I want to ship it out within the week. If I, if you win a gift card, I want to ship it out instantly. Like I trust me, I am. I am becoming more evolved. This, my hair is terrible. Jeez. <clears throat> <laughs> Cody, nice try. No, I sent her a $50 gift card. I see it right here. F 50, not 500. I did send someone a really big gift card on accident once. I put a couple too many zeros in there. <sighs> mm. Get a shipping manager. <laughs> well, the thing is, I have a shipping manager for all the the orders, the southforfishchannel.com orders, but giveaways is different. When I do giveaways, I man I handle those orders myself because they don't go into our system and I can't put them into our system. So I have to like manually do it. So that that's why, uh, that's why I was always really slow on it, but.
Oh, we got a couple more orders. Wait, what are we at? What are we at? Mac? Oh, wait, no. Mac Mac was a filmer. Wait, filmer? Who is that? Is that who I think it is? Oh, my God. Hey, thank you. Thank you for ordering the seasonings. I think I know who that is. Big thank you. All right, what are we? Oh man, we are at a thousand and ten dollars. Let me update the sales, and then let's give away. Let's give away an electric reel. Let's do it. Because if I am so slow, if I keep being as slow as I am now, can I use giveaways as a tax write-off? Unfortunately, I don't. Mm, wait, let me think. How did I write them off this year? Uh, no, gift cards. I can't write off. I can't write off gift cards as a as, as a tax write off. Because think about it. If you could do that, you could un send unlimited gift cards to create an unlimited amount of orders that never get shipped out and you would never have to pay taxes. <gasps> Is there a loophole here? Hmm, I'm gonna have to look into that. <laughs> oh no, my nose is starting to drip. Cause I've been a little sick, but I started feeling really good. Like I felt started feeling better today, but now my nose is running out, which is weird because I'm taking all these anti, oxidants which should be making me feel really good so i don't know why i'm getting sicker i should be getting healthier <laughs> robert just says no you're drunk with a period the period makes it so harsh all right <clears throat> i don't want to talk about i don't want <laughs> careful the irs is listening listen my taxes got are done perfectly it's all good i have multiple people look over my taxes i'm not worried about it I'm, i make jokes sometimes okay um where were we oh yeah more giveaways let we gotta pound through these giveaways before i start forgetting what's happening okay what um okay so Let's do the fishing reel. Let's do the electric fishing reel giveaway right now. I got it pulled up on my laptop. All right, this is everybody. Let me remind you guys how awesome everybody is about what's happening. So everybody that went to southfordfishingchannel.com in the month of March, it says it right here. Get one entry in our monthly electric reel giveaway for every $1 spent. So anybody that made an order during March right now is in this freaking ungodly thing that I put together. Well, I didn't put it together. I put the list of people together and then I put it in this thing called miniwebtool.com random line picker. And it is going to pick a winner by the way if anyone is wondering no i don't want to get into okay i can't say that <laughs> i'm about to divulge way too much information that i just know. <laughs> i was about to be like this is how many orders were placed last year i mean last month i mean in the month of march in the month in the month of march All right. Are you guys ready? If you placed an order in the month of March, first of all, thank you so much for supporting my channel. And every order really helps big time. And um, at first I was a little worried. I'm like, okay, I'm going to start giving away an electric reel or something like a $500 value item every month. 
at first I was like, oof, this might kind of backfire on me. But then I thought, how can that backfire on me? You know, I'm giving back. Even if we get the same exact amount of sales that month, it's fine. I, I make, honestly, I make most of my money from the software and all the other crap I do anyway. So even if my rig sales are absolutely zero, that's a joke, by the way. The fishing channel is basically full-time job now. Or is that a joke? Just, I, I need to shut up. <laughs> I just need to stop talking. I'm so stupid. Oh, I hate myself right now. All right, here we go. Pick a random line. You ready for this? This is for the electric reel giveaway. Kraken X electric reel for everybody that has placed an order has an entry in here for the amount of money they purchase. And even if you use... Um, Everyone in the in the fishing club, whatever your monthly club membership is, is also part of this. Bam, ready for this. What about April? Well, April, Jason, April's not April's not over yet. So the April giveaway, real giveaway, is not until May first or the first uh, Wednesday of May. Ready? Here we go. What just happened? Oh, it did. Oh my God. All right. Okay. I'm sorry. I think this is the first time I've used this website. Normally it pops up on the screen and it flutters a bunch of people's names that are on the list, but it didn't do that. And it just randomly picked the person right there. Mike, Mike Irwin. You see it right there. That's the random line that it picked. Geez, this website is terrible with all the ads it has. Uh, wait, I just want to make sure that you guys see that right there. Mike Irwin. Is Mike Irwin in the chat right now? Please tell me he is. That'd be really great if he was. Give away one Bitcoin, bro. Can't give away a Bitcoin. Mike, can we give it up for Mike? Is Mike Irwin in the chat? Is Mike Irwin around town? Thank you, William. Congratulations, Mike. Mike, you just won yourself a Kraken electric reel. But don't worry, if you made a purchase in the month of March, I'm I'm still about to give you guys some more gift cards, and if you're in the live chat right now, I'm gonna I'm gonna give another gift card right now to somebody in the chat. But congratulations, Mike Irwin. Let me quickly, Mike. Hold on, I want to just make sure. Mike, Mike, Mike. Why does that name sound so familiar? I've seen it before, Mike Irwin. Okay, Mike Irwin from Tampa. You want me to say your social security number two? I'm just kidding. I don't have that. But Mike, all right. The last thing. That, okay. Mike. Oh, oh, Mike. Okay. He placed an order on March 31st, the last day. Holy shit. I'm not even kidding about this. Hold on. I want to show you guys this without divulging too much. Of, damn, I can't do this without giving away all of his, his address and stuff. Can you guys see that right there? Okay, hold on. I'll just tell you guys right now. March 31st at 11.18 a.m. Oh, that's a.m., never mind, p.m. Okay, so he pretty much was one of the very last people to get into it. He bought a couple of sea witches, some grouper rigs. And he won. He freaking did it. Is he? Mike is a rather common name. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Stop congratulating Mike. He's got enough congratulations. I'm just kidding. 
She thinks, okay, this is what happens when I drink. Word things come out of my mouth before I think about them. And then I'm like, that was stupid. Why did you say that? Or like, I'll be like, like even right now in this moment, I'm like, shut up. What are you talking about? <laughs> and I still have, oh my God, if you, well, I, I still have a half a bottle. This is, this is me, a half a bottle of wine deep. Okay. Oh boy. All right, but I came prepared. I brought my pen and pencil. And I will put it on here. Mike. Mike Ir Irwin, electric reel. Awesome. So freaking awesome. <sighs> I'm a cheap drunk. Uh, Cody, Heiko, I need your help. Anna Maria or the keys for Steph and it's 10 year. Anna Maria or the keys? All right. Uh, I don't know what Anna Maria is. So I don't know. Cody's, the other Cody in the chat says Anna Maria. That, yeah, I should do a collab with Key West Kayak Fishing. I, I'm pretty sure that guy banned me. I'm pretty sure I'm banned on his YouTube channel. <laughs> oh, that's okay. <laughs> but, mm. See, these are all things that I should not even bring up. Yet here I am twirling my glass. So, okay. If you were here in the beginning of the stream, I mentioned that I twirl my glass like this. This is something that I love to do. And I will do it until failure. Because it, there we go. Failure. Order. Thank you for the order. Order in the court. <sighs> oh, I was about to go into song. Okay, how do I clean up the wine off? I spilled some wine. Okay, I know. Just had to sip it off, easy. Yeah, that wine is going down smooth. See, I don't even have to get you guys to, to convince me to chug it anymore. I just chug it now. Oh Lord, oh Lord, oh Lord. All right. Okay. <sighs> Okay. Is that wine chilled? No, it's not chilled. It's just sitting here at room temperature. <laughs> no, no, I don't what through Jack's camera. No, no, don't don't say screw that guy. Uh, Key West kayak fisherman, kayak waterman, fisherman. Wait, I'm I'm mixing up Aaron and Key West. Kayak fisherman. He seems like a super chill dude. He goes deep into his business, which I think is super cool. Um, I think I think he's I think he's a cool guy. All right, I don't have a problem with him. Okay. Actually, he was a big inspiration for me. For, uh, yeah. All right. <clears throat> Do I like Aaron? Oh, uh, I've never met him. I don't know. I've never met him. Hey, Brian. What up, dog? Welcome to the stream. Do you have a glass of wine? Damn, boy! Look at me in the... Oh, wait, I gotta turn this way. Look at that. Look at the old school videos going on here. Look, that's me at a clean 162 pounds. 162. Now, I, I got 210 pounds of titties on this machine. 
You know what everyone says to me when they meet me in Publix? Or, well, wherever they meet me, but I meet so many people in Publix, it's funny. They always go, whoa, you're a lot bigger in person. And I'm always like, yes, that's right. <laughs> I mean, I am, um, my ID says I'm 6'1", but some people tell me I'm 6'2". And I've, now that I got the titties, now that I've added the titties on, it's pretty nice. <laughs> Bar. Oh, man. Justin, can you put... The Put on the video you're in. What video are you in? <laughs> oh, that's JM Productions. That sounds like a good collab. Uh, cooking with Clams. I've been talking to Cooking with Clams for a while. We're, we are trying to... Ew. We are trying to get into a collab together. We're going to do it soon. Okay. Let's, let's, give a, let's do a giveaway to the chat. All right, I can't keep giving out fifty dollar gift cards because I need to. I need to at least not. I need to at least be up on my day. And uh, I broke a GoPro today, so I'm down. I'm down like three hundred dollars, plus my fixed cost of living. Two hundred. But these sales offset it a bit. <laughs> My brain is running way too hard right now. I do daily accounting. It is crazy. All right. Damien, don't even try to answer the questions. Nobody even... Stop trying to answer the questions in the chat. All right. All right. Here's a... All right. You know what? You know what? Fuck it. I'm going broke today. Another $50 giveaway gift card giveaway to someone in the chat, $50, whatever. You know what? Screw it. <clears throat> you guys help me out, so. What rig did I just pick up? What is the name of the rig that I just picked up off of my wall of rigs? All right. What is it? It's right here. That's the back of it. I'm not gonna show you the front, but what is the fucking rig? All right, you guys can't just say things like chicken or pompano. You gotta like, okay, well, I guess you could, yeah. But this rig has a name. It has a, an actual name. What is, okay, you have to say the name of the rig as it is stated on the SouthForFishingChannel.com. As it is printed on the package, the name of the rig. All right, let me look at the chat. <coughs> no, 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 wrong. Wait, what, what did they say? Wrong, 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 wrong. Everybody is wrong. Who guessed sword fishing rig? Clearly not a self or fishing channel.com enthusiast because I don't sell self sword fishing rigs yet. Plus, how could a sword fishing rig fit in a bag this big? I rest my case. Let the jury decide. All right, you guys are... You guys need some help, I think.
All right. All right, everybody stop. Just stop what you're doing. Stop what you're doing. Okay. Stop what you're doing. Someone has got the answer. And I'm going to show you. I'm going to show you right now. I'm going to, I'm going to show you guys. All right. Southforfishingchannel.com. How many times do I have to say it? Why do I not get 100 orders a day? Why? Probably because you guys want to save money and buy some shitty ass Chinese rig stuff from companies like Boone, where you think they're made in America, but they're not. <laughs> okay. All right, I got, I got to calm down. No, no, Boone, Boone's a great company. Okay, it is from China. <clears throat> mm. All right, wait, why am I on the website right now? Why am I on the website when I could just tell you? This is the rig I had. You know what this is? Do you know what this is? I bet the person that guessed it right knows what it is. Yeah. I bet the person that guessed it right knows what it is. Okay. So Okay, I just took them apart. There's three. There's three in here. Beer 30 just subscribed. Thank you. Thank you for subscribing. This right here. You have a beautiful shank hook to some nice 60 pound mono going to A barrel swivel and see that a barrel swivel some leader to a long shank hook what is that and why are mine so special because if you have a snap swivel right you, if you have a snap swivel what happens when you're catching mahi right what when you have 50 mahi behind the boat what happens right you put on a, a chunk of any kind of bait, you chuck it out there, and boom, Mahi swallows it. You got on the boat, he's freaking out. The hook's way deep in his throat. You're like, ah, what do you do? Do you cut the line and tie on another hook? No, you just unclip it, clip on another one, boom, you're back to fishing. It's the Mahi pitcher. It's how you get the most Mahi in your boat for the quickest amount of time all right where's the mahi pitcher where's the damn mahi pitcher every rig that i have on my shop is designed to save time because usually i create these rigs out of frustration of my own shortcomings like when i don't catch enough mahi because i'm too busy so yeah this is it it's the mahi pitcher they come in a three pack 750 oh my god i gotta change that price though that was pre-covid prices damn i got i haven't updated my website man i'm am i taking a loss on that why is it only 750 for three of them i think i'm actually taking a loss on that oh shit oh shit wait a second No wonder my fishing business is slacking so much. I'm taking a loss on half of my freaking products. Hold on. One second. <laughs> I'm about to increase prices. <laughs> mahi, 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 mahi. Mahi. Ow. I got a cramp in my foot right now. What the heck? <clears throat> Damn it. 
All right, I'm gonna change the price of this in like, I, I already have it set up on my laptop. I'm about to change the price of it. Does anybody want to buy any of these for $750? Because if you want to buy them for $750, I will wait like another five minutes right now. You can put in your orders. You could order some. But I, I, I'm increasing the price on those because I, I didn't realize that they were only $750 for three of them. <laughs> Thoreau's jackhammer said should be $1750. Right, I'm not going to make them that much money, but I, I got to increase them a little bit. I gotta increase that price there for a little bit. Oh, by the way, who got it? Uh, okay, who guessed it? Who guessed it? Who guessed it? Uh, okay, the first person that guessed my heat picture was I think JM 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 Productions. Hold on, I'm looking for their. Uh, it looks like JM Productions to me. Can we get a general consensus that JM Productions won this? <laughs> oh Lord. <laughs> Sonia, <laughs> Sonia said the, sorry, Sonia said the hooks that we use are super sharp. You had a yellowtail hook you good on Monday. Our yellowtail hooks are really sharp. I would watch out for those. They're, they're, they're rough. Wow. You think I should sell it for $14.99? No, I feel like that's too much. But th like, thank you, though. I do appreciate that a lot. <laughs> Martin Martin just ordered some mahi, a pack of Mahi pictures. Nice. Hey, remember, if, if your order is over 70 bucks, you get free shipping. Terry, thank you for your order. All right, uh, is anybody checking out right now? Because I'm about to change the prices and it'll ruin your checkout. So, all right, you know what? I'll just give that like 10 more minutes. But um, JM Productions, are you in the chat right now? And if you are, what is your name? Because I could just, uh, I could send the gift card to you right now. You know, that's how I am now. I want to I wanna send the gift card out right now. Because if I don't do it now, I probably won't remember. Unless I write it down. Jason Minter. Jason. Hey, Jason, are you IB Racing? Is something something? Is that your email? Ivy Racing. If it is, I'll send you your gift card right now. <laughs> yeah. What? All right. It is perfect. I got you. I got you. Send gift card now. Boom. All right. You got your gift card, Jason. Thank you so much for participating in the the live chat giveaway. Oh man, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be feeling pretty rough in a little bit. Okay. <laughs> I feel like, you know when you drink alcohol, it's like your your first few drinks are like you peak and then you kind of plateau. Like you don't get more drunk, you just like plateau kind of. And then it's like downhill. I feel like I'm like right here. And... Uh, I got like a, a little more than a third of a bottle left. Okay. Uh. 
Jam Productions. Yeah. Well, you know what? <laughs> Do two aspirin before bed. I don't take aspirin because it's bad for your liver. <clears throat> Holy moly, okay. Um. Oh my God, I just got an email telling me I have a home inspection. I have a home inspection tomorrow at nine in the morning. <laughs> you guys wanna know something crazy? <laughs> like, okay, these might not be things I just, I should say on a live stream. I don't have insurance on my house right now, but I have a home inspector coming at nine in the morning tomorrow. I'm getting the paperwork done and then I can apply for home, for home insurance. <laughs> so I always, I always thought, you know, if the house burns down, I'm screwed. I lose everything. I will put a, I'll put up my tent in the backyard and I'll live in that. But luckily the house is not burned down yet. I just have to like make it through another week or two without the house burning down and then it'll be all good. <laughs> it's all good. It's all good. It's all good. David, when's the club meetup? Oh, I, I talked about this earlier on the stream. Um, as soon as I hear of some good reports. The problem is we have a lot of wind blowing in weeds right now. So if we were to try to pompano fish off the beach right now, it would be a nightmare. Like all of our lines will just get covered in weeds and we won't catch anything. So, so yeah, as of right now, by the way, Martin, thank you, Martin. And welcome to the fishing club. Um, hope to see you in the, in our live chat and stoked to have you in the, uh, in the, um, in the fishing club. And I hope when we go uh, pompano fishing that we'll, we'll get a meet. If you guys are not part of the fishing club, you should at least be part of it for at least one month because then you get in the live chat and then you get all the info invites to our events and it's 20 bucks. One-time fee and lifetime membership. Come on. Come on. <laughs> but you can stay in it longer. You you don't have to leave. You don't, but uh for, yeah, join the fishing club. That's all it takes. Just push South Florida Fishing Channel.com, push join the fishing club, and then push join the club. And you can join, you can join for 20 bucks, 50 bucks, or 90 bucks. The only difference between them is you get more entries into our club giveaway. But other than that, everything is the same. So you could just get in it for 20 bucks, cancel it after a month, and you'll always be invited to our events and you'll be part of the live chat. But uh, honestly, stay subscribed as long as you want because it helps me out a lot. And the bigger the club is, the better the prizes will be. And uh, But once you cancel your club, if you stop paying for the club, you're still in the club, but you're not part of the giveaways anymore. That's the only that's the only thing that happens when you cancel your club membership. Ah, <clears throat> so much. Who is who? Who did that? Jack Smith. Thank you for your order. Ordered some mahi pitcher rigs. All right. I think I'm going to increase the prices now. I think I gave you guys long enough. All right, and the prices are increasing. All right. Well, I just updated them. All I have to push is the update save button. You know what? I'm going to I'm going to give it another 10 minutes. I'm going to give it 10 more minutes if ev if anyone wants to get them at $7.50, go for it now. But uh I'm 
but um I gotta update those prices or else I'm gonna <clears throat> dig myself a hole straight into bankruptcy. Mm. Scott Colt, Darcy just did a pompano in the boat next to shore and did very, very well. Yes, Scott, that's the thing. If you're in a boat, you can work past the weeds. If you're on the beach though, oh my God, it's such a nightmare. Trust me, I grew up in Vero Beach, beach fishing every day. If I came home from school, if it wasn't big enough to surf, I fished the beach and I fish Pompano and like, ah, uh, the wind brings, when there is seaweed, it is the most miserable fishing ever. You, you might as well like not even put a rod out. You just, but, uh, <laughs> what are people saying? <laughs> Cody, I wish I was as high as Florida homeowners insurance. If you sign up for the captain's one, you get lots of nudes too. I mean, I'm, mm-hmm. <laughs> Sonia says, Cody, you ain't right. Damn, boy. All right, all right. Let's do some more giveaways before I start forgetting what my name is. All right, let's do the giveaways for the, let's do the Florida Fishing Club giveaways because I think all the club members are on right now and I see them all, I see a lot of them in the chat. Let's do it, Florida Fishing Club members, let's do our giveaway, bam, let's knock it out. All right, Florida Fishing Club. Mm, what are our prizes? All right, so we have, essentially, we have three different pri- Oh, we just had an order. We just had two orders come in. <laughs> Jason, thank you for your order. Pompano rigs and some Mahi pictures. That's so funny. Brian, thank you for your order. <laughs> Got yourself some Mahi pictures. I uh y'all funny. Okay, um All right. So, wait, I thought I fixed I thought I updated this. Wait a second. Why can't I scroll on the page to show you guys what? Oh, here. Oh. Okay. So, okay. Um, a, a one change that I did to the fishing club is first place winner can now choose between three different things. A $500 gift card to South Florida Fishing Channel, the electric reel, or a guided fishing trip and dinner with me. Um, and by guided fishing trip, it can be anything, okay? It's most likely gonna be bass fishing, but um, it's a, a guided bass fishing trip with me and then we go and get dinner afterwards. But, you know, it. If the stars align and the weather is good, you know, it might be a little more than that. Okay. The last winner knows about that. We had a good, we had a really good time. Um, and then of course we have our second place prize. I mean, technic. Oh uh, wait, second place prize. Is a two hundred dollar gift card to South Florida Fish Channel, and third place is a camo backpack. Wow, I am my brain is fried. Okay, <laughs> Lord have mercy on me right now. Okay, um, so let's do it. Let's do it. Who's ready? 
fishing club members. What am I doing again? Oh yeah. You know what's fun about the fishing club is there's there's enough there's not so many people in it so we can still use the wheel of names. The wheel of names you can only put so many entries into it before it doesn't work anymore. But the fishing club is small. We're an elite group. You know, we're the, we're the fishing club, we're the elites. So we have there's not that many not that many people in it. Um, so we can still fit on the wheel of names. Let's give away third place, second place, and then we're going to do th uh, first place. But we're going to start. We are starting with first place. Ready? Or no, third place. This is for the camo PC fun fishing backpack. I absolutely love it. I guarantee you it's going to be your new favorite tackle box. It is epic. So here we go. Ready? Let's go. Damn, these lights are reflecting on the Mac. Dan Parton. Congratulations, Dan Parton. Dan, I don't think I've seen you in the in the live chat. I don't think you're part of our live chat group. Can you guys, uh, club members, is Dan, have you guys seen Dan Parton in the, in our Telegram group? Because that name, that name is kind of new to me. Okay, third. All right. Dan Parton, you just won yourself a badass uh, backpack thing. Nope. All right. People in the chat are saying nope. All right. Dan, Dan, you joined the club and you haven't even joined the live chat yet? Come on, Dan. What? You're just in it for the prizes? You're not in it to like mingle and tingle with all of us other club members? Come on, Dan. Dan, come on, Dan. <laughs> but congratulations, Dan. <laughs> oh. Oh, jeez, I have, wow, my nose is get, kind of getting stuffed. I thought I was getting better, but after this bottle of wine, I'm getting a lot better. Look at all the cooking going on. Look, double cooking. Cooking, cooking. Holy shit. I used to be so skinny. That is fucked up. Oh my god, look out. Look out. That's so bad. That's so bad. 162 pounds. I'm literally 50 pounds heavier than, than that dweeb over there on the screen. Look at that little wiener. I kill that guy. Too much wine. You know, he his heart was in the right place back then, but he just he didn't have good he didn't have the leadership that he needed. Pick a second place winner and a first place winner. Guys, oh! That is one bottle down the hatch. Yeah, baby. All right. <clears throat> hmm. 
All right. Yes, let's update the sales, actually. That's a good idea. Thank you, Tom. Um, what are our sales at now? We are at one bunk. Uh, one. We are at a thousand two hundred and sixty dollars and update and boom, you can see right there. $1,260 current sales. I said I was gonna drink a bottle of wine if we hit $1,000 in sales. And this is the last remaining amount of wine. Holy cannoli. The thing is, I, I want to offer you guys some more drinking opportunities. Like, uh, like I want to say, like if we hit fifteen hundred dollars, I'll, I'll drink, uh, I'll take a shot or something. <sighs> oh, but I'm, hmm. The thing is, you guys like content, right? You guys like fishing videos. If I start to drink a lot. This video that I filmed today is going to get delayed probably by a day. Uh, but, but maybe it's worth it. Maybe if it's worth it with, if you guys want to watch me get wasted. What kind of sick world do we live in? We're like, mm, give me more money and I'll get more wasted. The fuck kind of world do we live in? All right, here we go. Second place. This is for a $200 gift card to South Florida Fishing Channel. This is for our fishing club members. I spun the wheel. Peter Mayer. Peter Mayer. That's another name that I haven't, wait, have I, wait, Peter, wait, Peter, wait, is Peter? <laughs> oh, that's so funny. I just got a DM. Hey, I heard on your stream you're getting insurance. Let me know and I'll get the quotes, look them over for you to make sure they're good. I actually would appreciate that. So thank you. Peter. Peter, Peter, Peter Mayer, you just got yourself a $200 gift card. Peter, P Peter, hey, Peter, are you in the, are you in the chat right now, Peter? Are you in here? Not in the chat. Damn it, he's not in the chat. Why do we even do this? Why join the fishing club if you're not even going to be in the chat? I don't understand. I don't understand. It's like going to the strip club. It's like paying. Okay, this is what that's like. It's like going to the strip. It you pay you pay a cover fee of $50 to get into the strip club. And then you go to the strip club to go and eat a steak and then you leave and you never actually watched any strippers. That is the equivalent of joining the South Florida Fishing Club and not joining our club chat. It's like, then why did you even join the, the club? I guess, I guess you just wanted your $200 gift card, Peter. No, but thank you for all the support, Peter. And, uh, yeah, so, but who knows, Peter? I don't know. Peter signed up big time, too. Peter, Peter. You know what Peter was? You, do you guys know what Peter was? I'll show you right now what Peter was. Peter was a captain. He paid $90. P 
Peter paid $90 to be part of the South Florida Fishing Club. It got him six entries into the giveaway, so clearly it worked. He won his $200, but he didn't join the club chat telegram. Interesting. Interesting. I'm just saying that's interesting. I don't know. That's interesting. I don't know. <sighs> All right. Are we ready? To give away another electric fishing reel. Or, well, it doesn't have to be an electric fishing reel. All right. Let, we're spinning the wheel one more time right now. And I'm getting toasted, baby. And then, and then I hope you guys stick around till the end. Because I might get a little crazy with the gift card giveaways to the live chat. I'm just saying, if you stick around to the end, I might give out... Some more gift cards. I might ask some more questions because I want to have some fun and I'm having a lot of fun right now, honestly. This is the most toasted I've been in a, in a hot minute and I'm not even done yet. All right. Uh, so it's time to pick number one. And the winner of the winner of this, the number one winner of this fishing club, you can pick between an electric fishing reel, a $500 gift card to South Florida Fish Channel, or a bass fishing trip with me and dinner. And sometimes if the stars align, you know, like if there's not that many people on the flight, you might get a free upgrade to VIP, to business class or to first class. You know, it just depends on the weather and all that. You know, if if we have really good weather, I'll be like, yo, screw the bass fishing. Oh, we're going to do something better. But I can't promise anything in that terms. And you know what? The bass fishing is actually a lot of fun. And it's a little more mellow for me. Because when we can bass fish, it's like we can... I'll, I'll put a bunch of electric bikes in the truck. We'll go to my good spots. We can, like, talk and we can grill out. Or not grill out, but we can, like... It's more fun for me, but uh, okay. Anyways, I just I I babble on about the dumbest things. It just don't make sense. Okay, here we go. First place prize. And the ready. Oh Lord, boat dead. Denise Maru Denise, congratulations, Denise. Denise, let me write that down before I forget anything. Where's my damn pen? Boom, I got you. I wrote it down. Congratulations. Everybody say congratulations to Denise. Bam, please make her feel good because she should feel good. And she, oh my God, Denise. Wait, guys. Denise, Denise is in the chat. Yes. Oh, finally. A winner in the chat makes it so much better. Denise, congratulations. I got to ask you right now. Let us know. What are you going to pick? Electric fishing reel, $500? Or, or are we going fishing and having dinner? Which one is it? Which one is it? Uh, you don't have to pick now. But, but um, awesome. By the way, Denise... I don't want to spoil her secrets, but she was also a, a she was a captain 
a captain's captains uh, in the uh, in the fishing club. Wow. But you know what? You know what's crazy? We had two captains win this time, but I think the last the last couple of times, the deck mates, so like the the cheapest just buying one entry, they won first and second and third. So it but this time the the captains kind of came in clutch on this one. I don't know, that was cool. That was cool. And <laughs> Denise says I'm undecided. <laughs> yeah, well, take your time. Where do you live? Where do you live, Denise? Because the thing is, with a f if you try to plan a fishing trip with me, it's it's tough. It really is tough if you live like out of this state. Like I had a guy from Canada had one a uh, fishing trip with me once, and we could not figure out a date to make a fishing trip. <laughs> it was tough so like that's why you now have an option of like electric reels and stuff uh, if you can't make the fishing trip work you can just scoop up an electric reel oh my god okay first i gotta say big thank you to william tubbs jason anderson and juan caceres for joining the fishing club i hope you guys join our telegram chat thank you Cody, Steph wants to fish tomorrow. <sighs> tomorrow? It's super windy tomorrow. Wait, tomorrow? I can't, well, tomorrow I have a home inspection at nine in the morning and I have a really big meeting at 3.30 or at 3 p.m. tomorrow. So tomorrow is a really bad day for me, but and then, and then it's the 19th of day before my birthday. Can you guys do maybe any other, any other day other than this weekend? <laughs> this weekend is like super intense for me because it's my birthday and three other friends' birthdays. <laughs> oh, you, you, damn it, Cody. You said you're working. You're messing with me. God damn it. I'm already, I'm over here already trying to figure things out and you're just messing with me. All right, you know how we're gonna end the stream? We're gonna end the stream by doing giveaways to the chat because everyone in the chat, y'all OGs, you guys stuck around to this point. If you stuck around this far, you deserve a lot more than I could ever give you. I love how I can just check the club chat messages on my watch. I see Cody's posting a smiley face in there. Tom says, we're one of those vans. See, I can read everything. I know everything just through my watch. See that? I'm CIA, baby. <laughs> oh man. Denise, we met up at the boat show this year. The Miami boat show? Or was it the Isla Morada boat show? Denise. <laughs> Fancy watch. Ah, honestly, it's not that fancy of a watch, but it can go pretty deep. I free dove 120 feet with this watch. The Island Rod one. Okay. I, I know who you are then. I think we have a picture together. Sonia, I just saw your message. Um, I, I'm not sure. Honestly, I, 
you I don't know if you have to cancel your current one and then change it to the new one or I'm not I'm honestly not sure. But if you go to if you like go to your emails and search donor box, all your donor box emails will come up and I think the one will come up that'll tell you how you can cancel your account or maybe change it or you could just cancel it and change it. Will you drink a bottle of wine and go mangrove fishing again? I would love to see you get it bit one more time. Oh, you want to watch me get bit by a mangrove snapper? You sick, sick little dog, you. All right, you guys ready for a question? All right, how about this? All right, how about this? I'm gonna ask a question. Yeah, I'm gonna give a $50 gift card away again. It's gonna be a 50, all right? Might as well keep it fat, all right? Mo fat, mo better. But I ask one thing of you guys. Can we hit 150 likes? There's 120 viewers, or 110 viewers, just 29 of you have to push the like button. That's all I ask. As soon as we hit 150 likes, I'm gonna give $50 away to someone in the chat right now. Right now. Okay. And I already know I already know what the question is gonna be. Just kidding, no, I don't. I'm looking for it. No, I'm not gonna do another rig question. I'm gonna do a, I'm gonna do a, I already know. I already know. Okay, I already got the question. I got the question. All right, we're at 141 likes. We just need nine more likes. Nine more of you rascals, you little suckers, have to push the not nine of you. Oh, shit, we're at 144. Okay, six more of you have to push the like button, and then I'm going to ask a question. First one in the chat to answer it, $50 gift card. Damn, we are basically, this is a fire sale. You ever play a Call of Duty Zombies fire sale? Get it while it's hot. 147, we just need three more likes. Come on, three more of you. Three more beautiful humans pushing a stupid button of a thumbs up. What a deranged world we live in. All right, boom, we hit it, 150 likes. Thank you guys so much. Thank you guys so much. All right, here's the question. All right, so I have, I have, if you watch my channel a lot, you, you, you probably are going to know the answer to this pretty quickly. So I'm interested to see how fast people figure this one out. Okay. My mom is a painter and I am holding one of her prints. What animal is printed on this print? And I have the original hanging in my living room that you see in my videos all the time. First one to answer that gets $50 gift card. Bam! Go in the chat. Go in the chat. Full speed. Full speed. Who's got it? Cha! Bah! <sighs> Come on, come on, it's, 
it's it's an original artwork hanging right there in my living room. It's a huge painting. This is a print version of it, but it's a huge painting. It's probably been in at least 30 of my videos. Probably more than 30 of my videos. You have been able to see it hanging there, right next to the Mahi. Just beautiful. Hmm. Hold on, I gotta check. Mm. I want to listen to music so bad right now. Ugh, I want to listen to music. I don't want to listen to my own voice anymore. Okay. <laughs> I would be the worst, like, full-time streamer. Or maybe I would be the best. Who knows? I think I would be actually pretty good. If I went down that degenerate route, nah, no, I wouldn't be good. I wouldn't be good. I'm only good like once a month because once a month I can splooch a little bit, drink on stream, do that. Nah, I can't do that every day. All right. The winner is. Oh, wait. Why don't I show you guys? All right. So. If you know, you know. Ready? Boom! We got the XL version hanging out there. It's an iguana. Super dope. Super dope. I wonder if my mom still sells them. Like, my mom used to be a really big into artists. Uh, artistry. Painting, painting, um, oh, wait, her website's still up. What the heck? Huh. Wow, I didn't know my mom still did that. I bet if someone placed an order right now, it would confuse her so bad. Okay, wait, okay, I'm sorry. I just got so sidetracked. I got, I just got so sidetracked. Look, look, wait, hold on. Okay, I we're about to pick a winner, but I was just... So I just went to my mom's website. Hold on a second. Look at this. This is my mom's website. Um... Jeez, she should have hired me to build her website. But, um, so her website, oh, you can't even see it. It's AnnetteWinkler.com. I can't even, like, sc scroll to the, oh, okay, there we go. AnnetteWinkler.com. You can see her name right up there in the art studio. She did, she did some paintings for like, for Elon Musk and, um, and the other guy, the Virgin Mobile guy, I already forgot his name. And she did some really cool paintings. Uh, she did a lot of paintings for Steve Irwin, um, uh, for the Steve Irwin Foundation. But if you go to shop and then you go down to Animal Kingdom, 
then uh, there it is. The green iguana right here. Oh, the under the warm sun, this lion picture. Oh, it's so good. Like the original ad is so good. And the prints. The prints are so good of that one. Um, of like a lion suntanning. But the iguana one. See, it says contact us to purchase, but if you select a quantity, let's just say eight, 18 by 24, that's a pretty big one. The bigger, the better. $130. My mom is, I don't even know if she like, she hasn't painted in like two years because I don't know, she just lost her, uh, Mm. She worked so hard with all her painting. She painted for like 10 years straight, never stopped. Oh. If somebody can go on here and order a painting, I don't care what you order. If somebody ordered any one of her paintings, that would be awesome. I'm just like curious what what would happen she would probably hit me up and be like hi go somebody placed an order somebody ordered one of my paintings <laughs> oh man wow that would actually be pretty cool i don't know i don't know you guys don't have to you guys don't have to do that but it's just she has a lot of stuff on here united states of america Remember that. You know what's funny? When I left for college, my mom turned my room into her art studio, like within a year. And I remember I came home and I was like a little offended because you know, you usually you come home in your room, you still have your room to come home to and you, no, my room was an art studio. As soon as I left. <laughs> oh, man. Classic. It's so good. All right. Okay. I'm so sorry. All right. Who won that? Let me scroll up for a second. The answer was Iguana, and the winner is... Mandy Taylor. Mandy Taylor, you got it. Mandy Taylor. Steph, my mom is a babe. Wait, did I show a picture of my mom? Was there a picture of my mom on this website? No, there wasn't, was there? How did you guys see what my mom looked like? Huh. <laughs> Lieutenant Dan. Man, okay, yeah. How come I can't play music? I can't play music because YouTube will copyright strike me in an instant. It's terrible. Um, Mandy Taylor, what can you, what is like, can you give me the beginning of your email address so I can just send you that gift card right now? Because I might already, if you're in my system already, hold on, let me see if I have you in my system. No, I don't not, I, I don't have you in my system. Mandy, can you send me an email at heiko at southfordafishingchannel.com? Oh, 
able to put it in here. Heiko at South Wharf. There, that's my email address. You can send it there. But Mandy, if you are willing to sacrifice your life, you can post your email in the live chat and I'll send you a gift card right now. <laughs> but who knows what kind of weirdos you have. Oh, perfect. I already have your husband's. All right, what is your husband's email? And you don't have to give me the full email. If you just give me like part of it, I can start typing it in and it'll pop up on my in my database. That's all I need. I'm over here like, Mandy's going to sacrifice herself. And you'll, you're going to have 20 boat daddies hitting you up. Be like. <laughs> oh, man. Steve-O. Honestly, I have not seen any of the fish kill going on down here. So it's all good down here for me. <laughs> Damn, why is everyone saying my mom's a babe? Jeez. Jeez. I mean, uh, you know, I've had friends tell me that growing up, and I'd always be like, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Mandy. All right, let me see if that pops up. Yep, I got him. I got him. I got him in here. All right, Mandy, you can tell your husband that a $50 gift card Bam! just got sent to you. Congratulations. You just got a $50 gift card. Boom, boom, boom. <sighs> nice. Cody says, I'm going to Google Heiko's mom. Wish me luck. Wait. If I go... If I Google my mom, sure. no, I should not do this on a live stream. I don't think this is a good idea. It's not even a good idea that you guys can see my previous searches on Google. That's bad. <laughs> what am I doing? All right, Annette Winkler. All right, her website is the first thing that pops up. That's not my mom, by the way. That's the Star Trek lady. Yeah, my mom part painted for Star Trek, for SpaceX, for the... She painted for um, the Steve Irwin Foundation and a couple of other things. Oh, there she is. That's a cute picture. I think. See, there's my mom with Steve Irwin's son. And there's my mom with the Star Trek lady. Yeah, my mom's got some like pretty nice paintings. Okay. All right, that's enough Googling on my mom. Jeez, what am I doing right now? This is not the, this live chat. This should not be happening right now. <laughs> Cody. <laughs> Dr. Tom, top shot contestant death. Why did I Google that? Um, 
it why did I Google that? No, there was there was a reason I Googled that. It was Top Shot. Something with Top Shot. Yeah, no, I wasn't trying to like find like a um I was trying to because I was trying to ha I had a vision for this uh reality show that I wanted to build and I remember someone dying in it and I was trying to find out I was trying to remember why they died so I could make sure that didn't happen when I do that <laughs> that's funny hey Mandy listen if you guys if you guys want to buy one of the the iguana print, it's it's a nice print. I guarantee you guys will like it. And I'm just so curious what my mom will say. Like uh if she gets an order. I just want someone to order some because she she stopped promoting this so long. She like it's kind of like sad to say. Like I think she she like gave up on it a long time ago years ago and like now she's like into realty she does like a lot of realty stuff she doesn't do any more painting and i don't know like you know sometimes you wonder if your parents are happy or not i don't know but i just posted in the chat that's her website if anyone wants to order a painting i don't even know what will happen like she might get these orders and be like ah what do i do <laughs> Oh man, you know, maybe it'll like, it'll give her some inspiration. I don't know, but uh, it would be cool. That would be cool, I think, actually. Honestly, I would be happier if somebody ordered one of her paintings and put another order in on my website. For sure, 100%. <laughs> Cody says, at the beginning of the live, I answered a question with your mom. What a turn of events. Oh, man. Kenneth, the Star Trek lady is Lieutenant Uhara. Oh. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is the end of a bottle. We have drank an entire bottle of wine. Holy smokes, I did not think I was going to get through this, but I did. I actually, I actually got through it way easier than I thought it was going to be. I'll just be completely honest with you guys. Easy, easy. Uh, music question. Okay, the reason I can't play music is because I will get demonetized if I play play music oh it sucks <laughs> yo cooking with clams good to see you in the chat <sighs> I think that I'm going to do one more giveaway one more one more $50 giveaway To somebody in the chat I'll do one more all right we'll do, we're gonna do one more all right one more and then and then I'm gonna go clams oh yeah you're good man you missed me drinking a whole bottle of wine but it's okay, because I got the cork. <sighs> I decided, I don't think I'm going to drink anymore tonight. No, I, there's just, there's no point. There's no benefit. And I got to wake up at 7, all right? <laughs> oh, man.
Joey. Tomorrow is Captain Dan. Tomorrow is Captain Captain Dan's birthday. Yeah. Oh yeah. I just ordered the Enjoying the Sunset from your mom's website. Joey the Dime, thank you for the twenty dollar donation. You just ordered the Enjoying the Sunset from my mom's website. Damn, Joey, thank you so much. That is, that is really cool, actually. You're, you're gonna love that print. I like, it is so good looking. You know, that's, that's an investment too, you know, there, that's an investment. Like, yeah. Wow. Thank you so much. No, that actually makes me so happy. <laughs> that makes it's weird. Wow. That's weird. I don't I don't want to discuss that. <laughs> All right. Um, hold on a second. What am I doing again? Okay. Um, Okay, that's right. I said I was gonna give away another fifty dollar gift card. Um. All right. I have to think of a question. Yes. Yes. Okay. Um. Hmm. Hold on, I'm gonna be right back. I'm gonna I'm gonna grab something that I can use for this. One second. Answer the question right, get a $50 gift card in the chat right now. What do I got in my pocket? What do I got in my pocket? What's in my pocket? Right there in my pocket. <sighs> yeah, you can hear it shake. Ready? Yeah, you can hear it shake. Cha-cha-cha, baby. What do I got in there? What do I got in my pocket? Oh, that hurts my ears so bad. Why did I do that? What's in here? What's in my pocket? Scott, did I break up with Caitlin? Come on, man. That happened like two years ago. 
Yes, two years ago we broke up. <laughs> All right. All right. Y'all ready for this? Y'all ready for this? Yeah, bull test. We got ourselves a whole bunch of bull test. Oh yeah. Who got that first? Who got it? Who got it? Who got the bull test first? All right, the first one that answered the question correct is Harrison Burnham. Yours outdoors, you were kind of, like, I see where you're going with that, but you said book set. And I, I could tell that you wanted to write bull test, but that is not even close, which is sad because I know that your heart was in the right place. But Harrison Burnham, you got it first. B Mandy, you were, Mandy was like a close second. God damn, Mandy, you almost got your husband another, another uh, gift card there. All right, who, who is it? Who is this, uh, wait, hair, wait, what is, Harrison, Harrison Burnham. <laughs> oh, yours outdoors says that was my fat fingers. I have to give it to Harrison though. I hope you understand because, you know, I just, yeah. Oh, Sonia, I just saw that you uh, changed your uh, your club membership. Sonia, Sonia's a captain now. Damn, son, damn, damn. All right, okay, okay. Welcome to the fishing club captain's quarters. Um, Harrison, let me see if you're in my system. Harrison. Burn him. All right, Harrison. Is your, does, is your email a hotmail? That's all I got to ask. Is your email a hotmail? And if it is, I got you in my system. I'll send you the gift card right now. Let me know. Three hours? Wait a second. I've been streaming for three hours. Oh my God, I have been streaming for three hours. Jeez. Oh, damn, okay. All right, that explains a couple things. Hey, honestly, honestly, I could. I could probably do another bottle of wine, but I'm not going to. But for a future stream, maybe for next month's uh, big giveaway stream, two bottles of wine. Oh no, I should not do two bottles. I might do it. I don't know. I'm not. I'm not saying I am or not, but hmm, not a bad idea. Cody, what was my favorite moment of the year so far? Um, Harrison, I just sent you a $50 gift card. Bam, you got it. 
Congratulations, Harrison. Thank you so much for all the support and sticking around and all this. <laughs> Sonia, I figured I've been following Heiko for seven years now, so what the heck? He's the worst. Dang, come on. One more hour. Damn, Steven. Steven, you just told me it's time to end the stream. Now you're telling me to go for another hour? I don't understand. <laughs> um, favorite, favorite, wait, what was the question again? Favorite moment of the year so far? Honestly, favorite moment of the year is probably, I don't know, probably being in Utah and seeing my family. <laughs> Something I didn't even film. Because that doesn't happen a lot for me. So that was probably the best. <laughs> uh, probably a boring answer for you guys. But yeah. Gotta take it while you can, you know. <laughs> Scott, now you're telling me? Oh, wait. Scott says get to bed. You know what? I might not go to bed. I might just eat a bunch of bull test and have a really handy dandy night. <laughs> oh, man. Hmm. I don't know. You know, I'm I'm out of I'm out of drinks. Holy smokes! What is going on in that video right there? Oh no! I forgot about that one. I'm definitely gonna cover that up. I can't believe that's still. I can't believe that's still on my YouTube channel. Gee. If you go like, if you go really far back on my YouTube channel, there's some weird things like, I, like this video right here, that one, right? That video right there, where I'm talking about time, temperature, and tide to catch shrimp while I have my foot in the screen. And I'm like, is my foot distracting you? I'm like, what the, I don't understand the stuff that I do. <laughs> all right guys you know what i'm i'm sitting here thinking it might be time to end the stream and honestly i'm having i like enjoy i enjoy seeing all you guys in the chat seeing everyone here it's nice but uh i have to be up early and 10 o'clock is kind of like my bedtime i try to be like in bed by 10 and I try to be up by 7 because usually if, I, if I'm in bed by 10 it takes me about an hour to fall asleep and then I get my 8 hours of sleep and I wake up at 7 so that's the uh, that's the goal Hey, Boonskis, for some reason that Monster Energy Drink logo gets me stoked. I don't know why. <sighs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. You guys say some funny stuff in the chat. <laughs> 10 o'clock, the porcelain altar. Oh my God. All right, guys, I'm gonna get off for the night. I'm glad we got all these giveaways away. The uh, the electric fishing reel, 
and all the uh, reels are going to be shipped out probably either Friday or Monday. It's it's up to PC Fun because I what I do is I send them a, a spreadsheet of my orders because I had some issues with my card. I can't put in multiple orders with my cards. I don't know the fishing club members know this issue, but so I do. I use spreadsheets now. So they'll either ship them out Friday or Monday, and everyone's going to get their gifts. And uh, I'm just going to wake up tomorrow and friggin' hit the hustle hard again like every other day. Damn, I was just thinking like about like relaxing, like relaxing. No, I'm going to relax. I'm going to relax for like 30 minutes before I go to sleep. The thing is, if you like just lay in bed and go to sleep, it's, uh, It's over so fast, like, and then you don't even get to relax. Yeah, so I'm gonna, I wanna relax for a little bit. The Mahi picture still shows 750. Ah, I refreshed the page, I just updated it. It's $11 now. <laughs> yeah. I had a fight with her. Who are you talking about? Are you talking about Caitlyn? Like me and Caitlyn, we do not get in fights. We are. What's there's nothing to fight about. She can do anything she wants, and I can do anything I want. And. It it's really funny because everybody. Uh, I don't even need to get into this right now, but I will I will say this one thing because I had so many comments I, I read like 50 not not 50 but I probably read like 30 comments a day about this whole thing with me and Caitlin Nobody and I'm gonna tell you nobody has any idea what that situation is about or even remotely close to about the, and remember this in like five years from now you're gonna see me in in a certain like and you're gonna be like wow okay yeah <laughs> but uh just <laughs> i don't know how to explain it well actually i do but i'm i'm not going to and it's like it's it's not one it it is completely it's so far away from what everybody thinks and yeah but i don't i don't i have learned over my many years of being on youtube eight years many relationships hmm, two serious ones a lot of small relationships i've gotten to the point where i'm like i'm not even going to bring relationships into the channel anymore and like, if you see a chick on my channel, if you see Caitlyn on my channel or another girl on my channel, it doesn't mean anything. Or maybe it means something, but you won't know. It's just, that's it. You know what? I'm cool with everybody. Everything is cool with everybody. There's, yeah, that's it. <laughs> that's it. Jesus. All right. I'm ending the stream. And hopefully I get a fishing video out for y'all in a couple of in a couple of days. And other than that, the hustle continues. And remember, we have a software company. So if you if you have a product idea or a business or anything, that's our jam. Enzo.com.
<laughs> David Chapman, good to see you in here. But yes, we are we are heading out. <laughs> 